So today we're up here in um, Bim Badger Winery up in the beautiful uh, New South Wales Hunter Valley and we're um, installing a, uh, a beautiful Calabresi Grande. The end result I think is going to be uh, spectacular. So what we have is we have a beautiful 1500 degree rated um, pizza oven cast that we, we manufacture here in Australia. Um, these, uh, these ovens are all made by hand and, and meticulously uh, crafted. Uh, this one's a, a commercial oven, so it's a larger style oven. But this one has a few different advantages, so we up-spec the interior to make it, uh, to make it last uh, a lot longer, so it can handle that heating and cooling of the thermal shock. Easily lifted with a forklift, one piece. Specifically designed for commercial restaurants, the ceramics in these ovens is, is, is extremely good. They're, they're a lot harder than a lot of the overseas uh, ceramics. As you can see how thick they are, this is the chamber wall. Most ovens are at 50 mil, ours are over 120 mil, 100 mil for commercial ovens, so we upspec them. The tile itself is in a cast floor. We use these um, in, in all our ovens. A fire uh, brick floor, it's fully pressed um, and, and uh, can withstand up to 1500 degrees. These ovens are designed to withstand that, that heat uh, consistently every day, uh, up and down, up and down, up and down. So heat loss uh, in, in most ovens is through the floor, so we, uh, we insulate the floor very you can well. see everything comes pre-cut. Go. There's no, uh, no guesswork. Let's follow the instruction. Beautiful one-piece dome, 120 mil thick. See the better the, the oven in one piece, the, the less joints there is, so less wear and tear over time. But if we have to do it in three, we will. We have a technique to, to make them in three. The oven itself is is, uh, is is very good quality. Designed for commercial applications. Perfectly correct and in line. The refractory cement, cement is an air set mortar, probably the best mortar you can buy on the market. So we we'll use it in all our ovens, and, and it never breaks down. So what we're doing is we're putting the, the arch on the front here. So center it up with the front here. And we're going to get that beautiful shape, and it'll meet up perfectly around the oven here. The insulation part is the most important part besides the floor. This is what keeps your oven hot. Layer it so that you stay snug and warm. Next step is to put the wire on so that the, so that the, uh, the render has something to stick to. Oh, it's going to be nice. It's, it's, I mean, that nice smoky country feel, yeah? We're going to plan on putting our signature dish into there now with our roast duck. It gives us more flexibility in our cooking style and uh, a, a different different version uh, of roasting and, and cooking. We're going to have uh, some ribs, we're going to have some chicken breasts coming up on a salad. Um, we've also got some salmon that's going to be going in there. So a, verse, a, a wide variety of uh, different things, just uh, going through the thought process of what can go in. Well, having a pizza oven like this at Bimbaja and it's going to obviously going to boost up and the restaurant and the flavors and the more technical cooking techniques will be a, the cooking in an oven is a whole different technique than cooking in a normal oven so you'll have you'll see more more varieties of wood cooking than just basic cooking it's going to be a whole different world and can't get anything better than that so there you go hard day's work come up with a beautiful uh, beautiful oven don't you think looks good the chefs are excited, um, the, the, the customers are excited, uh, and I'm privileged to offer a product uh, to, to these guys that I know that's going to be fine dining and fit in with their food culture that they have here. I definitely look forward to part two, coming back and seeing the, the chefs in action working with it. Um, I think the, the food is going to be spectacular. Look us up on the internet.